What's good all? Welcome back to my channel, Chrissy Talks. Y'all homie Chrissy. And happy Labor Day. I'm sure some of y'all are happy to not be going to school and work. <laughs> I bitch still gotta go to work. But let's go ahead and jump right into this video. So I woke up about an hour ago. Please excuse my crusty ass voice. And I saw a post on RTL Shade pertaining to rapper Asian Doll and artist and YouTuber Ty Taylor from the Taylor Girls. Now honestly, I didn't even know that these two were friendly until I saw Asian at Ty Taylor's party. But I also felt like sometimes in big celebrity or YouTube parties, they just be inviting everybody or people just be coming. It just be a random party list. But apparently they are friends to a certain extent. They have been hanging out. They even have a version where Asian did a bundles feature with the Taylor girls and Kayla Nicole, but they chose not to go with that version. So anyway, let's fast forward to the tea that we have for today. So basically and allegedly, Ty Taylor and Asian Doll went to the studio with Future. Asian did apparently announce that she has an upcoming song with rapper Future and so they were all in the studio together and an Asian spilled some tea to a tea group on Twitter. I'm gonna post the audio for you guys in a couple seconds but basically Asian says that while they were at the studio together Future was kind of feeling Asian's vibe and asked her to play some of her songs for him and Ty Taylor actually took the opportunity to play some of her songs instead. Now just for a quick heads up in this audio you do hear I got scoop or whatever the fuck whoop de whoop you hear that throughout this audio to basically trademark where they got this from i'm assuming so it annoyed me i just wanted to <laughs> just want to tell y'all it might annoy y'all and you know it's there y'all welcome this you know that girl that i was just with the um the taylor girl so she ended up yeah she yeah yeah up, yeah God, she cool. ended up uh she wasn't supposed to the studio me i was with myself but she ended up coming y'all know my little friendly ass so y'all welcome future ask me school to play my um play my shit well i guess like they was vibing to my stuff but, like why she get up and try to play her shit i said uh-uh <laughs> like, what i'm like you got to put in work for this you just can't bitch you know how much work i done put in like that's what i'm saying you need to stop being so i like, see it on future face future was like he was like he made like a sound like, he was like uh-uh like he did like that so I'm I'm reading his mind like he don't want to play shit. So I, I'm like, nah, I'm like, you tripping? Like this is this is this, this about Asian. He said Asian play her music. God I too. Cool. Hey, he said Asian go on stage. Time to start taking yes. these hoes. So I also want to comment on when Asia says, y'all know that Taylor girl, like it made it almost seem like she ain't know who Ty was, but it's like, girl, you know who the fuck we talking about. I felt like that was a little shady, but some people apparently thought that she might have been drunk during this recording. Either way, you could be drunk, but you ain't going to forget your friends, you know what I mean? And then as a celebrity, you know who you're talking to, especially if you're specifically addressing a T page, like, you know, I mean, I don't know. I don't be out here getting drunk. So I don't know the extent of alcohol, but it's like some things, I feel like some things just got to click. Especially because some people were pointing out that Asian most likely wouldn't have liked it if somebody went to a tea group specifically to kind of air some things out about her. I mean, what celebrity would? Because you know people run with shit. All I got to say is personally, I think they're both wrong. I feel like even though Ty, you know, felt like this was a time for her to promote her music, she could have done that another time. She could have done that after Asian did. You know, I just feel like it's so cringy to hear that Future was asking Asian, but Ty went ahead and played her music. Like, I feel like that's such an awkward moment. And then on top of that, according to Asian, it seemed like Future wasn't even really fucking with Ty's music. And honestly, I wouldn't be surprised. Only, no shade, okay? I'm not saying her music is bad. But it's definitely not something I feel like Future would be looking for in terms of partnering with. Sorry, y'all. I probably still got crusted in my eyes. <laughs> I mean, I actually heard a quick snippet of the Taylor Girl's upcoming song that's coming out. It actually sounds pretty good in comparison to the other songs. No shade. But I mean, on one side, I get it. You know, I always try to understand people's perspectives. And she took the opportunity to show her music to a well-known rapper. But at the same time, it just wasn't the time for it. And it's like you're literally fumbling your friend's bag. And Future wasn't asking you. Apparently, allegedly. On the other hand, it was definitely wrong for Asia to talk about this, especially if she spoke about this to a T page. You know what you do with that information. So point blank, I just felt like they were both wrong in the situation if this really happened and Asian could have spoken to her outside of the internet, basically. I feel like Asian doll has gotten better when it got to the drama, but some people think this might be a repeat of the Ty Taylor and Kim Nicole situation. I don't know how much attention this is going to get. You got another rap an artist and who's supposedly your friend 
trying to downplay you even though you did some fucked up shit yourself first for her to be in the position she is and tell a t group apparently it's like you was intentionally being messy and then you know you're in a position where you're a rapper and you're talking about me and another rapper feature like this could fumble my bag so therefore i gotta speak out on the shit y'all stay tuned we do not know <laughs> what's gonna happen if this is gonna blow up i would rather it not but i'm sure there's a good chance it will but that is in my video i hope you guys enjoyed comment down what you guys think below do you guys think that ty taylor was messy for playing her music in front of future first do you guys think that asian doll was messy for putting this information out there to a t group and do you guys think that the situation will escalate just like ty taylor and kayla nicole the other week comment down what you guys think below find my instagram at bestachet at christy two s's two y's i love and appreciate you guys and i'll see you all in my next video bye guys